What's going on YouTube? Welcome back to the channel. My name is Alyssa Morrison or The Alyssa Morrison if you are new here and today I am sharing with you a really quick easy get ready with me before we jump into today's video make sure that you are subscribed by clicking that big red subscribe button down below give this video a big thumbs up it really helps me out a lot and let's just jump in this week has been a really really long week but amazing and just honestly a huge monumental week in my life i actually launched my own brand this week this past friday i did make a video talking all about my brand it's a small jewelry business called local the label you guys can check it out at localthelabel.com this past weekend i've just been relaxing doing all of the self-care and just taking a much needed break for myself i've already moisturized my face but i'm just going to be taking the say i think that's how you call it <laughs> Uh, glowy super gel in the shade star glow. I'm obsessed with this. I just take one pump And I like to start on the high points of my cheeks and my nose But really I just end up putting this like everywhere <laughs> It gives such a pretty glow to the skin and then I'm going in with my Invisible Zinc Tinted Daywear Mineral Shield SPF 30. I love this. It provides a little bit of coverage, but it's also like very, very glowy, which I love. You guys know I have super, super dry skin, and this just gives me such a pretty sort of luminance to the skin while also giving me that sun protection that I need, especially if I leave the house, which is kind of a rare occurrence these days. <laughs> The warmth of your fingers really blends it out nicely and see you can still see my skin through the sunscreen it's not like any sort of crazy coverage but it does give you like a more even skin tone and very glowy is with this this is my favorite curler from amazon all of the products that i am talking about will be listed in the down bar below I'm just taking an old favorite this is the maybelline colossal mascara i also tend to get a lot of mascara on my lid just because my eyelashes are growing pretty long and to just leave that until it dries okay so while that excess mascara is drying drying i'm just going in with the nude sticks sun kissed this is just the most perfect sort of bronzy terracotta blush and i'm just taking that like pretty high on my face like kind of where you would apply a highlighter i just really want the blush to like lift my face and then across my nose as well just for that overall sun-kissed look i haven't used self tanner in a while i've been kind of exfoliating all my layers of tan off lately so i'm not going in with any bronzer today just because it would not match the rest of my body i think this gives a really pretty natural blush but it also get, makes you look like you got a little bit of sun maybe a little bit of sunburn which is what i love to which is the look that i love to go for because most of the time, most, <laughs> most of the time I'm wearing so much sunscreen. I'm just gonna take this spoolie and brush through them. They haven't been tinted in a while, but it's okay. I'm just gonna take the Anastasia Clear Brow Gel and just run this through the brows a little bit. My eye wires grow so long, so brushing them up is not always the best <laughs> idea but i do like to give them a little bit of a lift especially in the front and then just kind of feather the product through they are a little out of control right now taking that seam spoolie i'm just going to lightly get the mascara off my lids just by like lightly brushing the mascara and it will just kind of flake off like that I don't always do this, but I'm taking the Becca Opal, what is this? The Shimmering Skin Perfector. I'm gonna take like a big fluffy brush and just dab it in there and then just hit the highlights, the high points of my cheekbones, my nose. Finally, I'm just going in with the Freck XL and I'm just gonna draw a few little freckles up on the top of my nose and then down. I'll, I will get a little bit closer. It's very subtle. I don't like them to be too 
like in your face and fake looking. The final step is just to set everything. This is the Milk Makeup Hydro Grip Set and Refresh Spray. I love this stuff. It gives me such a pretty glow. And then this is super fine. I don't feel like it moves the products around at all. It just sets everything and looks so fresh. I'm going to go out into some better lighting so that you can see what it looks like. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching today's video. I will see you next week. And again, if you do want to check out my small business, it's just localthelabel.com. Thank you so much for watching and we'll see you next week. Bye.